Today, we're going to change the flywheel assembly on a Yanmar L48N engine. Firstly, we need to remove the cover from the engine. Loosen the four 10mm bolts holding the cover in place with a 10mm spanner. The nut holding the flywheel in place will be tight, therefore you will need to shock the nut. This is when you apply force to loosen this part. To do this, you will need to tap the spanner using a hammer so it loosens the nut holding the components in place. You can now remove the nut. Using a 10mm spanner, remove the three bolts holding the starter pulley in place. Now remove the spacer which sits behind the pulley. Assemble the flywheel puller tool so you can loosen the flywheel. To do this, you need to thread through the large bolt in the middle of the puller, then position and attach to the flywheel. Using the three small bolts and washers, place them through the puller tool and secure to the flywheel. Using an 18mm spanner, hold the puller tool in place so it doesn't move. Then loosen the bolt to remove the flywheel from the engine with a socket spanner. Once the flywheel is off, remove the puller tool attached to it. Flywheels are a sturdy component of the machine, however are a common part in any engine that can get worn due to high usage. Now is a good time to check the flywheel for any damage, and this includes checking if it is worn or if the fins have chipped. You may also want to remove the flywheel to access other components such as a flywheel key which might be sheared or the ignition module. You can now replace the flywheel. Align the wheel up the shaft and place the flywheel back. It should be stable if in the correct place. Place the spacer back into the middle of the flywheel. Then screw the nut over the top of it. Return to tighten with an 80mm spanner before fixing the starter pulley on. Get one screw inside the pulley and line it up with a hole on the flywheel. While in place, use a 10mm spanner to screw into position, fixing it to the machine. Now, continue to fix in the next two screws. Further tighten to make sure there's no movement in the pulley. It's important that the starter pulley is tight, as it could potentially damage the machine. As a tip, prop the machine up so it's leaning back. This will make it easier to fix the front of the engine back into place. Place the cover back into position, making sure it's seated correctly. Using a 10mm spanner, screw the four bolts into the front of the engine, making sure the cover is secure. That's how you change the flywheel and the Yanmar L48N engine. All the parts and tools needed for this task are listed in the description below. Please like, share and subscribe if you found this video helpful.